Previously on Cyberpunk 2077. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left. Like I said, Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Now back to Cyberpunk 2077, episode 14. Okay, so after that shit show happened. Back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Oh, stop it. Stop it. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. Ah, uh, You'd have loved to drop an H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. OTT? things for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. Ugh, don't remind me, bro. Think fingers has got her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Hmm. Anyways. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah, he's right. Claws are not gonna forget that shit show that I just did. In fact, who knows if they're after me right now as we speak, plotting their revenge. But for now, I need to find Evelyn because time's ticking. Whoa, 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 whoa! What the fuck? Yeah, it's happening again. Come on, V. Shit. V, come on, get a hold of yourself, please. No, no, damn it. Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. No, oh, that's nice. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score meet Semlin. And I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. What? He... Wow, so he basically wants me to, what, finish what he started at this point? Let's get out of here. I've recruited into a terrorist cell before. <laughs> Listen, honored, I know things. Where we can save your life. Who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. You know, you're just an irritating hallucination, right? Mm -hmm. You should just ignore And you're me. a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. Damn, that hurts. You fucking asshole. But as should be obvious, I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an M. Don't trust you. Clear, right? So why would I trust in your plan? That's a good question. Why? You've heard your death now, but you'd rather live. So if you're done bitching, I'd be happy to explain. Sound good? Okay. Fine. What's your plan? Okay, so this... Makoshi. What is it, exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. 
Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. Damn. The contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Mikoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my ship problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Not when I'm stressed. Years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our bids. You yours, me mine. And uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? I won't be surprised. Bombs named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is. Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. Okay. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi. Okay. Well, we'll definitely get to that later. Right now, we need to find out exactly what happened to Evelyn and how we can get this chip off. What's this? First, we'll calm the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. Whenever money changes hands, your true self becomes a victim to capitalism. The best weapon against capitalism is uninterrupted meditation. Corporate oppression will only end once you stop oppressing yourself. Okay, so that is a very weird message. Thanks, I guess. <sighs> I need a bike. Where's my bike? Hey, there's Jackie's bike. Okay, so... I'm on my way to Jig Jig Street. Ah, this is Jigjig Street. Okay. So what I'm looking for is right in here. So there's more up your alley than clouds. Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Oh my, place has a wicked vibe. Hmm. <laughs> oh shit. B, can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Here, kitty kitty, what's the old rush? Friend. Well connected to the influential. Why so mysterious? Get to the point. I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting. This friend of mine. Great. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Konpiki Plaza. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Um, that's a word flex, but okay. Fine. Where's the meet and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Sweet. Yes, I love this. Anyhow. Alright, Johnny. While you enjoy this vibe, I got some business to attend to. Yo, this bitch is moaning. Like, I don't even know where she is, but she's just moaning. And, um, I got a random robot with a dildo? A strap. Oh, fuck me. Look 
looking for a ripper duck. Goes by fingers. Nowhere I can find him. Who's asking? And why? Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up. All these fucking questions. Yeah. The best for joy girls. Are you a whore? Are you a whore? No, but you are, from the look of things. Yo, you hear what this bitch said to me? Best watch your tongue. Or I what? Again, but what for? Your little skull sponge can't possibly get its gray cells around it. Let's apologize for that bitch. <laughs> Got to be worth a damn to get an apology from me. And you're trash. Not worth shit. Damn. Nobody talks that way to little loco. That's you, little loco? Okay, bet. Okay, bet. First of all, last time I checked, I have a katana. Let's go. Hold on. There you go. Anyways. Come on, little loco. Come on. Aw, no one's shooting? Aw. No one's saying shit. <laughs> Quiet ain't no back talk, bitch. Oh, that was so good. Man, this is so funny. Pepperoni pizza? Oh yeah, it was worth killing you. Shit. All right, little local, what you have? Fuck it. Dude, these guys were so annoying, but I'm glad I killed them. Alright, looks like this is not going to be easy. Oh my god. She's dead. Hmm, okay, so this bitch is dead. He's tripping balls. Like, really? What's in here? Anyways. Hey, you all right? No way I'm gonna swim. I hate water. Can't you see nobody cares? What the fuck, bitch? Fingers. Know where I can find him? If I could, I'd swap, you know? Why does everything have to be so damn convoluted? In the end, all you got left are shredded cables and empty bottles. Are you tripping balls? Yeah, you are. I should have known better than to ask. Like, what the fuck? Alright. Yeah, this place is... Where is this? And clear. Don't need to yell. What's up? Doing a little competition. Shoot prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. Uh huh. That that'd make sense. Well, you in? Didn't think big parties were your thing. Yeah. Well, it ain't a big one, but you know, run it low on heads. Let it bring in the clients. Attract them and shit. Ah, okay. Try selling iron straight from factory. Skip the whole part where you tinker for hours on each little shooter. V, my dignity, please. Sure, I'm in. When? Well, uh, right now. We're waiting on you. What the fuck? I'm busy, you son of a bit. Oh my god, whatever. I'm busy, bro, like... Alright, I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. What the fuck? 
Is that fingers? No, that's a pimp. Cool. And I assume that's a joy toy, right? I don't owe you shit. <laughs> oh, but you do. And then right. she has a name. Something around twenty thousand. <sighs> that's a lot of money. Judy? Uh, Hello! There's a line! Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn! Fingers guy. You know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like. His hand sometimes slips. Hmm. Hmm. No wonder he's called Fingers. What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. Hmm. You say this whole time you knew Evelyn wasn't at Clouds? Who do you take me for? Why would I lie about something like that? Because you don't trust me. You're right, I don't. But that doesn't make me a liar. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell did she go back to Clouds? <laughs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. She sounds stubborn. <laughs> Same. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get into see than the best docs in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front. Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. Hmm. <laughs> Means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how exactly? <laughs> you knew where she was. Sprang into action. Yes. But once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. So she your bay, okay. That's cool. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. Hmm, that makes sense. Okay. Think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere? On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God no, because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. Alright, so it's come to a conclusion that Evelyn and Judy have a thing together, and they met at the at the clouds, and she fell for her hard. It's cute. Alright, so she's sick. She's sick. Everyone's sick here. What the fuck? All right, let me see something. Hey, so um, you seen a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here. No idea. Gotta ask him. Hmm. I need to talk to him. It's important. You think we're just here to polish our nails, huh? Honey. You cut in front of me. Thank you. Real pain in my cleat mitts. You know that? And you might as well hmm. knock and find out when he's mopping up. Supposed to be a goddamn clinic, not in any of your blonde Go on now. Don't floor. you worry about her. Thank you. You're so so sweet. Thank you. Let's go. All right, we're busting through that fucking door, and we can't. Oh. Yes. Yes. Hello. Your fingers. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I know she was here in your clinic. Ah, so that's what this is about. Where is she? Ah, a loaded question if I've ever heard one. Why are you avoiding it? You tiger claws! As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? Where the fuck is Evelyn Parker, you stupid asshole? I already told you. Come on. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. 
Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. To feel like... Like they deserve it. Of course... Quint Shittery, soon as I mentioned her name. Don't try getting out of this. I know you remember her. I, I have a neurological condition. It's not easy living with ticks. Really, I'd love to help, but... If only I knew who you were talking about. Oh, you have a neurological tick. Well, you know what? I can definitely help you out, buddy. Suggest you start remembering all you can. Either that or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Yeah, Two come on. Papers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Oh, now you remember. Want details, damn it. Name the studio. They mentioned a moth, of all things. Virtues with a dead head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Thank you. Bitch. Me there. I'll be outside. Oh, Lord. Okay. Well, that went well. And we know exactly what happened. And he's a fucking creep. Um, y'all can do whatever you want now. We're good. Judy. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her. I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together! Wanna give up now? No. Only Lee, we got some XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Negative Nancy, bro? Come on. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the moon almost always. It makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. There you go. Have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Okay. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. There you go, see? Some optimism for once, bro. Let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. Bet. Alright, so dark net it is. Now I gotta locate a terminal. Call it a day, I guess. I'm getting the gill. That means you and me got a problem. Now I could paint the sidewalk with your guts. Okay. So I got a terminal. Oh, you wanna try? Go on, son. Let's see what happens. Pleasures of Night City. Okay. 
Oh shit, time for me to hack. Noise. So when it comes to hacking, at first it does get a little bit hard to do. But after a couple tries, it's actually relatively easy and pretty fast to execute. Okay, so what am I finding exactly? Huh. So I'm just researching at this point? Uh, okay, I guess. Brain dances? Let me see. Huh. So there's a dealer, an ex-BD dealer on Jijik Street, so let me go to the guy, see what I can find, and he's right there. Giggity. Okay, serial killer. See, wasn't so hard. So, got some classics from the last Corp War, or armed robbery if you're looking for something fresher. Hmm. Weirdo. Anyways. What are you looking for? Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? Yeah. You a badge? The fuck? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. I'm no connoisseur, trust me. <laughs> sure. All I need to know is who makes them and where. Now listen, I just sell whatever sells. Nice, calm job. Mm -hmm. Let me see some eddies. You can pick one. Parse it, and I won't care a hair. Got anything that might interest me? How much is this? Oh! That's not bad. I'll buy that shit. Alright. Pleasure doing biz with you. Okay, Judy. I got some interesting stuff here. Hopefully this will help us find Evelyn. Because at this point, what other options do we have in finding your bay? Thank you for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies. Hope you stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.